Do you know investing at these valuation levels of Bank Nifty has generated a return of over 45% in the last 10 years? In this video, I try and illustrate why investing in financial services sector is hugely rewarding for investors and also show you fast returns using our in-house risk for return framework. I thank the Marcellus team for the content of this video. Before we go ahead, let's have a good look at the data compiled by the team at Marcellus. As you would have observed, over the past 20 years, Bank Nifty has delivered a 9% return over Nifty CAGR. This observation is on a rolling return basis over one year period. Now, if you were to take it at a CAGR basis also, Bank Nifty has delivered 16% return versus the Nifty return of 10%. The results are more or less similar or even more favorable in Bank Nifty if you were to take a period of three year rolling return or five year rolling return. Many investors believe that investing in financial services sector is riskier than investing in non-financials. How do you measure it? You can use Sharpe ratio, which is nothing but the excess return over Indian GSEC, which is a risk-free return. If you were to look at Bank Nifty's Sharpe ratio, it is at 0.45 versus Nifty's 0.27. It actually means Bank Nifty has delivered 60% more returns for every unit of risk taken. Now you may say volatility. Of course, the Bank Nifty's volatility is higher than Nifty's. But if you were to look at downside deviation, it is similar. One other observation is that Bank Nifty has generated negative returns lesser number of times than Nifty itself. And the number of times it has generated three consecutive quarters of negative returns is less than half of Nifty. So just using standard deviation to calculate volatility and say Bank Nifty is more volatile is not the right thing to do. One of the key observation is that whenever Bank Nifty has had a drawdown of more than 10% in a month, it has taken only 10 months to recover versus Nifty, which has actually taken more than 14 months to recover. Finally, now let me show you the number of times Bank Nifty has been there at these valuation levels in the last 10 years. Please note, these are pre-COVID numbers and the number of observations stands at 12. You'd be happy to see that the one year and the three year returns are very high. The other thing that you have observed is that the mean and the median numbers of three year returns are pretty close to each other, confirming uniformity. Hope you like this video. Please do follow us and subscribe and also let us know which is that sector that you want us to analyze next. Thank you.